Hello, my name is Sanjay Ruwali. At Wipro, I lead mainframe and mid-range services. Three important aspects as I see them. First one, building a holistic business case around modernization. Let's start with the problem statement. Why do we want to modernize mainframe? Is it about cost, skills, uh, legacy code, or mainframe is not fitting well into your digital journey? It could be a combination of reasons. Building a mainframe modernization plan, which will deliver against these objectives, is the critical first step. The technical solution and commercial case. So whether it's uh, in-place modernization, or you're moving away from platform Z by means of rehost, rewrite, or refactor, these will predominantly be the solutions under consideration. Besides the technical solution detailing, it's important to identify and build a commercial case around the whole project. So now let's talk about cost versus timeline. For a large, and multi-year project like mainframe modernization, it's possible to get into situations like project delays, underachieved targets, solution changes, etc. A good financial modeling for the project is very, very essential. When it comes to mainframe operating cost, it's largely about the software, which is the biggest spend on mainframe, followed by mainframe hardware and hardware maintenance. Do you know all your software and hardware cost for next five years. What contractual flexibility you have with your software suppliers if your mainframe modernization eventually starts reducing the mainframe utilization? Do you get a uh, flexibility there from your vendors? These are some very important questions. Knowing them upfront and including them in the business case will go a long way in assessing the success of your modernization program. Do you have all the risk identified for the migration phase and do you have a related mitigation plan? Continued service availability during migration, that's been the biggest concern most mainframe app owners have. Now, you, have, you may have been operating mainframe for decades in the traditional way. Post migration to cloud, your support structure will go through some important changes. If mainframe rehost is used, you may still require some of the mainframe centric skills at target. Application and data security will be a lot different on mainframe versus on cloud. Your disaster recovery and business continuity planning will require an update as well. My third point is about orchestration, which is a very vital aspect for a large and complex project like mainframe modernization. This typically involves effort from multiple entities, sometimes multiple firms. I'll give you a case example here. For a recently concluded large mainframe modernization project for a US customer, as a global system integrator, we at Wipro orchestrated the entire effort across multiple functions and vendors. Now, if you notice, there are more than eight different parties involved here. And it's very important to bring everybody together and work towards the eventual outcome. So that's the role of the orchestrator. I'll end this session with a question. So for your modernization project, who is on the driver's seat?